A scribe status describes the social status a person is assigned at birth. It's most prevalent in the caste system, a rigid form of social hierarchy characterized by people being born into their social tiers called castes and remaining in the same caste for their entire life. Since people cannot change the ascribed status they're born with, the caste system has low social mobility. In this video, I'll share my visual mnemonic to help you remember all the information about a scribe status and the caste system so you'll be ready for test day. First, take a look at that castle in the back. Isn't it grand? By the way, this castle coincidentally helps me remember the caste system. Get it? Castle for the caste system? The caste system is a form of social stratification or a system of inequality in which people are grouped. In the caste system, people are born into a social tier called a caste, where they remain for their entire life. Kind of like the lifelong differences between royalty and peasants in the era of castles, social groupings are extremely rigid in the caste system, and social mobility is very difficult. Remember, this castle should remind you of the caste system. Hey, what's going on in front of the castle today? It looks like something important is happening, and a scribe is here to record the event. See that scribe there? Well, the scribe here should remind you of a scribed status. Get it? A scribe for a scribe status? The caste system and a scribe status go hand in hand. Let's look at what the scribe is recording to learn what a scribed status actually means. So, what is the scribe recording anyways? It turns out today's an important day for the kingdom. The baby is being crowned prince. Isn't he cute? Just look at those chubby cheeks. By the way, this baby's coronation coincidentally helps me remember that a scribe status, such as that found in the caste system, describes social positions that are assigned from birth. Get it? The baby is being assigned his status as a prince from birth, just as a scribe statuses are assigned at birth. While the caste system is the prototypical example of a scribe statuses, other examples of a scribe status include statuses based on gender, race, family origins, and ethnic backgrounds. I'm talking about statuses that you didn't choose and can't change. Contrast this against achieve status, which describes social position attained through merit or other accomplishments. This baby's done nothing to earn his title as prince. But now that he has been born a prince, he'll get the royal treatment for his entire life. Remember, ascribed statuses are given from birth. All right, that's it for ascribed status and the caste system. Let's recap quickly and get out of here. Ascribed status describes social positions that are assigned at birth. They're the most prevalent in the caste system of social inequality, which is characterized by rigid social hierarchy and low social mobility. Now we're done with the scribe statuses. I'll catch you on the other side. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also support our team by visiting pixarize.com, where you'll find exclusive videos and interactive review images. If you like what we're doing, share with your friends on social media, and we'll keep making great content like this. We'll see you next time.